Squatchy. Um, go check out that installation video, the previous one. This is um, one of those hat displaying devices, and I've been working on this in the past couple of weeks, and um, been you know looking for ways to display my hats even better. And as you know, I displayed it on my door there, but that only lasted so long. So this is definitely another space saving product so go check out that video before this one um, if you want to know more about the squatchy but here it is I'm gonna walk you through these all my hats uh, I have about 47 hats and more coming and I'm gonna that whole top section above the closet there I'm gonna put more hats as they come in but this is all of it so far I won't fit in the whole video but um, I'm gonna walk you through them and then after that do a little bit of Q&A that I made myself. So um, all the way at the top, um, we got some primitive snapbacks. The top there, right there. Got a blue one and a red one. Um, there's the Maxis, Maxis snapback because I love Maxis tires on my bike. Plenty of SD Pied Race hat. Um, love a good red one. This one's also my favorite to wear, black and red. Um, plenty of hats from um, True Heads Clothing. So shout out to Neil for making these hats with a super fat XL laces. Um, I got several of them. So if you see me wearing these, True Heads clothing with a Z at the end of heads. Um, the bump box hat, because you know I like to uh, bump my music loud with bump box. Um, the Power Rangers hat collection, um, especially the one that I'm wearing, which you'll see in the uh, other video of the new hats that I've acquired. Um, John Deere hat, when I wanna, you know, up my widest Asian up a notch. Um, People ask, have I been on a John Deere tractor? Yes, I have. Um, when I went to um, Philadelphia back in fifth grade, um, school field trip, there was a John Deere tractor and a rode one, it's really nice. Um, my favorite 4th of July snapback um, truck I had with the uh, distressed uh, American flag. Um, got that one at, um, got that one at a, where did I get that one at? A gas station uh, years ago. This is one of my oldest hats in the collection. Uh, Mike's Taco Club, if you're ever in uh, Ocean Beach, some pretty good tacos. Um, another hat here from uh, Taco Shop, Taco Surf. A uh, great place in Pacific Beach for some tacos, burritos, all kinds of Mexican food. Um, Public Enemy, gotta have Public Enemy. Red Tecate hat, courtesy of Wee Big Incorporated. Um, Maui hat, because my parents went to Maui a couple weeks ago. Suicidal tendencies hat, um, which I'll explain um, in the, uh, soon. Um, metal militia hats, um, some new hats that I've explained in the other video that I've gotten. Um, dope hat right here, two of them, I just like. That, I thought that was a cool design. Um, little metal on a hat. Nice white one, but gets dirty easily. The NWA hat, definitely one of my favorite hats. Um, similar to the ones that NWA wears in some of their pictures back in the 80s. Um, so great hat to have. Um, 
Make America Grip. This is a Snoop Dogg um, album, so I thought it was a cool hat to get. Um, Newfound Glory in the uh, Blockbuster font. Eric Clapton right here. When I saw him um, many, many years ago in concert, he was great live. Um, Cabo San Lucas hat. Um, my parents went to Cabo, so they got me that hat. Um, the, my, everyone's favorite, the coronavirus veteran hat right here. Um, um, nice snapback, or should I say Velcro back hat. Um, I got that from, I don't remember where I got, online somewhere. Obi hat, cause uh, you no, know, God love Obi. Um, nice beach town, um, famous beach town. Um, at the bottom here, Evans drum heads hat. Some of the best drum heads in the industry. Pearl drums, cause you know I'm all about pearl drums. So I had to get a snap back um, for my favorite drum company. And I hear all the way at the bottom, Newfound Glory and the. NBA, um, kind of like Miami Heat, Chicago Bulls. Um, what's that um, font there? Design from their album. Um, what is that album called? Greatest of All Time, Infinity and Forever, or something like that. Don't remember. And right here, um, Marvel hat at the top. Another new Found Glory one in their camo. Very nice. And Cocoa Beach, Florida hat that my family got me because they went to Cocoa Beach uh, last year, the other year, I believe. And up here, the America hat. Um, from Wee Big, uh, I explained that in the other video, the new hats that I've acquired. So um, that's about it. Plenty of SD Padres hats, plenty of Ones with the uh, shoelaces here, a lot of trucker hats, a lot of snapbacks. Um, that's my whole collection. And of course the uh, Power Rangers one that I got here um, um, that, I'll, that I explained in the other video. Um, but yeah, let's do some Q&A. How many caps do I have? About 47, and I'm, there's definitely room for more. I got more of those squatchy hooks, and I'm definitely gonna fill that top um, part over there above the um, closet. What was my very first cap? It had to be the suicidal tendencies cap right here. Um, not the one that I originally got um, way back then, but um, when I went to go see Suicidal Tendencies way back in 2008, um, that was my first hat and it's been hats ever since. But it was a hat, just the same one like this one, the flip cap, OG flip cap, and um, yeah, it's been hats ever since. So that was my first hat. And, and it's been like, over 12 years and counting. What is my favorite cap in my collection? Um, maybe this Power Rangers one right here that I explained in the other video. Um, nice paint splatter that I got the other week. Um, but yeah, this is probably my, my favorite hat so far in the collection. And maybe, I know this is like a cheap hat, but maybe this um, 4th of July, um, I call it the 4th of July hat, American flag hat. Even though it's like eight or nine years old. <laughs> so this is my favorite hat in my collection. What is my least favorite hat in my collection? Um, Maybe one of these um, dad hats over here. I'm not a very big fan of like curved um, dad hats. But yeah, probably like one of these ones right here. The OB one. Not really like much. I don't wear that one a lot. For me, I prefer a good um, snapback or most importantly, a good fitted cap. <laughs> Which 
Which one is my oldest, my newest cap in the collection? Um, the oldest one so far is the um, trucker hat here with the American flag, the 4th of July hat. Um, I've had that one for like 7 or 8 years. And the newest one in my collection is actually this one I'm wearing right now. Um, the Blue Ranger, Power Rangers 5950 New Era Snapback. So that's the newest one that I just got today. And yeah. So that's gonna do it for this video. Um, that's all my hats in my collection. Um, shout out to the Squatchy again for creating such a time-saving, space-saving, uh, hassle-free uh, way to display your hats. And if you want to know more about that, um, visit thesquatchy.com, I think. I'll put a link in the description on where I got the uh, Squatchy. And um, here it is again, my hats. Uh, continue watching this video. And um, if you like this video, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you are a first time viewer. And uh, let me know what you think about my hats and, you know, share some experiences with your hats if you want. So that's going to do it for this video. Continue watching and we'll see the hats again.